The Georgia High School Association State Volleyball Playoffs getting underway Wednesday. Islands High School, certainly one of the teams to beat from our area. The Sharks, who've already set a school record for wins in a season, riding a 15-match win streak into the postseason. Sharks been one of the top teams in Southeast Georgia all season, opening the Quad A State Playoffs at home against Troop County. Just go ahead and get this out of the way. Veronica Searsant, uh, yeah, she's a cheat code. <laughs> Young lady, one of the best around. She drills a hole in the floor with that finish. She's doing her thing on defense moments later, turning away Troop on this one with the block at the net. Still more from Sears Ant. Aislinn Langen setting her up for another monstrous kill. Islands was off and running. Home team just getting started. Molly Lanigan's going to get it over to Aslan for the quick point. Sharks not letting up. Delaney Gordon going to dig it out. Lanigan's going to set it up. Back to Gordon, who comes up with a two-handed finish. How about one more from Sears Ant? Anna Collins to Lanigan. In comes Sears Ant from the back to finish things off. Sharks making quick work of Troop County, winning 3-0 to advance to the second round. Class single A private, Calvary Day hosting Stratford Academy to open the state playoffs. Cavs, they were wasting no time. Emmy Nash to Olivia Dusterdyke, who's gonna get it over to Tally Lewis for the finish. And Lewis, well, she was a busy young lady in the first. No need for Lewis to wait on the bump and set. She goes straight for the kill on the return from Stratford. Still more from the home team. That Nash, Dusterdyke, Lewis deal working wonders. Calvary, they were up six quick light. Cavs looking to get to work on the outside and the other side, but the visitors, they have nothing to do with it here. Coming up with the block for the point, but Calvary, went, uh, Calvary not turned away too often Wednesday night. Nash to Megan Halford, who gets it back to Nash for the kill. Even more from the home team off the Stratford serve. Lauren Baker over to Halford, who once again sets things up for Nash. That's another point for the Cavs. They take the first set 25-13. Calvary Day moving on to the next round after the 3-0 win over Stratford. Now we have even more high school volleyball scores from first round matchups on the high school sports page of our website, WJCL.com.